Alrighty, welcome back everybody who likes video games. Today we're going to be playing a game by my favorite company, NetEase. You guys know they are by far the number one mobile clone creating company. Like when I say that, I mean they're the best at replicating PC games and putting them on mobile, like straight ripoffs. I mean, we've seen Rules of Survival, you guys know that, which was a clone of PUBG. They did Fortcraft forever ago, which I think they eventually changed to Creative Destruction. And then a couple other that I just don't remember well enough because I never actually like got on board and played those. But today, we're gonna be hopping into their Valorant clone. Valorant Mobile has been rumored to be coming out for a while now, but with NetEase being NetEase, you already know they jump on creating these clones super quick and they already pushed out the beta for their clone, Hyperfront, which is what we're on here today. And I'm not gonna lie, the game's actually a lot of fun. Like it's, it's you know, one for one, a replica of Valorant with its own like twist on the characters. They call them heroes here in this one but most of the abilities are very familiar. If you're someone who has played Valorant before, you're gonna pretty much understand the mechanics and different characters and what they all do. For example, we have Elixir right here, which is essentially Sage. Now, a couple of her abilities are different, but you'll see her ultimate is Revive. She's got the Shrouding, which is basically a smoke, and then her healing passive. Then you might be thinking, okay, well, Sage has a wall in Valorant. Yeah, she does. And that ability is actually given to this character right here. And that's Coldcast. You can see that her basic is going to be a block. And then, yeah, the, a couple of the abilities are swapped around. But for the most part, the game's pretty much the same. Faith Arrow, I believe, is the character I'm going to want to run. And again, you guys are going to recognize most of these abilities here from Valorant. So we have a Scouting Arrow, a Burning Arrow, and then the Flaming Arrow, which is going to be the ultimate. Two of those are both damage. I've not played as this character yet, but I think that's probably gonna be the best for my personal playing style. I've been doing Blast, which has a rocket launcher, ultimates, three grenades, as well as a jetpack. Yeah, a propel ability. And I've gotten a lot of kills with the, the triple shot nades. Like, not gonna lie, they're pretty good, but I do think I would do better with the Faith Arrow. Just seems to be better with my playing style with the recon and damaging. So that's what we're gonna try to lock into here today in our ranked match. We're actually gonna be queuing up into ranked. I was curious on how the ranked play was actually gonna be. So I did play one match off stream and it actually is full real player lobbies, which is awesome, especially in a beta because I played a couple of just pub matches and I would say like four or three of the players in the lobby on the other team were bots. So it wasn't really satisfying doing well in those. But yeah, here we go, hopping into ranked. Last match, I'm not gonna lie, I got destroyed. I went like 10 and 10, so it wasn't good. We did end up picking up the dub though. So hopefully here in this matchup, I can do better. We're gonna go ahead and lock eighth arrow. And I'm hoping our team's a little sweaty here. But yeah, I know a lot of you guys are going to be wondering, okay, how do I play this game? And currently, it's only available on the Google Play Store, I believe, in Canada. I don't live in Canada, so I used a VPN to get it. But I'm not entirely too sure how open the beta is because I tried to make an account a couple days ago and it said the beta was full. And then I just checked randomly back the next day and it let me in. And also, from what I understand, when you launch the game, it says the beta is over. So I don't really even understand how I got into the game but I can play it, so I'm going to be making content on it. So starting off, we're going to go ahead and grab the USP and light armor. And if you guys, again, have played Valorant, you would know that the USP is basically the ghost from that game. Yo, low-key, I'm going to scout right off the rip and just see like what we have because there's three different positions I believe the enemies can be at here in the beginning. With it being a pistol round as well, I think I could take a one-on-one -on -one unless they have like a nasty shot. But I just want to know what I had in front of me. Someone smoked me off. Yeah, there's two here. They're like spraying into the smokes. This is kind of risky. Okay, we got a good shots on. I think if I just pre-fire, they re-peak. Something I've noticed a lot about players here in the mobile edition of the game as well is they love to strafe shot, and it seems to actually work out for a lot of the players. I personally coming from a oh, good bit of experience on Valorant tend to stand still a lot but on the mobile edition of this game it just doesn't Three seem to work out the same we got a nice little flank going sprayed up a lot of shots there not getting the kill I know I'm personally one hit so I'm gonna keep trying to play my life as much as possible we're gonna sprint at this person awesome one player left probably over here to the left judging by my team shots yep all right teammate picking them up and 
We ended up winning the first round. I stayed alive, bro. I was doing so much damage. Get ready. I'm assuming, yeah, I've got two assists and the one kill, so that wasn't a bad round at all. Another thing I've noticed about the mobile edition is a lot of people force buy on round two whatever they can, so we're going to be doing that. We'll grab ourselves an M4, which is the Phantom in Valorant, as well as some light armor again. I will say definitely this character does play out a little bit better for myself. I just realized I have 200 coins left over, so I'm going to grab a burning arrow as well, which as I'd mentioned before is a damaging ability. So we're going to do the same thing we did last round where we just recon mid. I'm actually going to challenge it. Figured we'd have a lot of enemies. Okay, I'll take that assist. I'm not sure if there's a guy on the catwalk. Yeah, I figured that guy was still sitting there. Challenge the catwalk. Nice. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and regroup with the team. See if we can get the spike or whatever the heck it's called on this game down. Oh, I can recon forward. Dude, oh, I saw him. It's like in heaven there. wonder what happens if I hit him with the damage arrow. That probably wasn't like super accurate. They're definitely just standing right there. Go ahead and watch the flank for a second. Yeah, these recon arrows charge quick. Nothing on flank. Our team's going down over there, so yeah, that meant the last player was over there, and they cleaned it up. 2-0, baby, let's go! I believe it takes eight rounds to win the game. I didn't take any damage that round either, so I technically could full save here, but I would rather have... Hmm, yeah, I'd rather have the full armor, so I'll go ahead and spend whatever. Since I've constantly challenged mid from that right-hand peak as well, I'm gonna go ahead and switch things up, go to the left side here. We're still gonna recon first, so if they're, like, smart smart, they'll know that I'm here, but I just want to switch things up a little bit. Oh yeah, we do have another player there. I think they might have the marshal whatever the heck that is in this game got some shots down uh enemies flanking us right now i'm gonna go ahead and start walking so they don't know i'm here all right i'm gonna wide peek this with my teammate oh is that who is that i can't tell if this is like phoenix or if that's supposed to be um ko's final ability i feel like that might have been like ko's ability but they have the ability to freaking get revived go ahead and like pre arrow that i'm flanking this guy and because i was walking they had no idea oh take that double kill just like valorant or cs if you swapped your knife you do run faster and that's the only way since there's no like sprint sprint in this game and we'll go ahead and get that easy clean up there on the last player it is for beginners i would definitely recommend if you're going to use an ar to pick up the m4 just because that's the easiest to like run and gun and spray with and grab some new armor as well as those burning arrows i really want to get a kill with one of the burning arrows speaking of which by the way i do have uh my ultimate which is pretty nasty so if i got like a recon shot down and then charge up the alt i should be able to like shoot somebody through a wall that again i'm not too familiar on how it's going to work or like convert over just because a lot of these abilities they are from valorant but they might work a little bit differently like actually i might be able to just what deflect that off of walls oh yeah just like that okay okay let me try my alt Go ahead and shoot it. Why not? Star core deployed. So there's nobody over there, which means enemies are probably... Yeah, the majority are flanking. I want to scout mid. I've marked the targets. I'm actually kind of on a flank here. I'll treat your wounds. Three so if I press remain. that, that allows me to deflect. Run into ashes. That's so cool. Okay, cool. Uh, this last player should be mid. Oh, going down to the AK. What I hit him for? Like 160? Hey, I'll get the assist, though. I'll get the assist. Yeah, so the AK, just like in Valorant, the Vandal is going to be a little bit more strong. So up close, I think it can win fights a little bit easier. But just, again, for the ease of use, that's why I was going for the M4, AKA the Phantom. Now, the Scar, I'm not entirely too sure what this is supposed to be, but it does cost a lot of money and from what i understand hit pretty dang hard so this might be like a sort of alternative to the vandal but with like m4 type recoil or something i don't know i haven't really figured that out i will say these arrows are op though go ahead and deflect that and what are we getting with the recon one here oh i thought maybe those would be good sprays I think I got the guy in the back. Also, that's got to be Reyna's uh, stun right there. This is a nasty angle. Hold up. Oh, they ran and gunned me? What gun? That's what I'm saying. I still don't fully understand the like movement mechanics of this game because people sometimes full sprint and still wreck you. I think it's because a lot of players play this like COD where they're like sprinting ADS and their bloom isn't awful at mid range. So a lot of those shots end up hitting, which to me is just a playing style in this style of a game. 
that doesn't make any sense. So I really don't know how to combat those people that are like sprinting at me. There might be like an SMG variant that's kind of familiar to like the Spectre that people are using that's extremely accurate. Oh, maybe like the UMP or Vector. Yeah, I want to say the UMP is probably the Spectre. This is the last round here before the swap. And I have just enough money here to buy half armor and the Barret, which again is comparable to the op in Valorant, which means it's a one shot kill to pretty much any part of the body besides the legs. Hmm. Go ahead and blind fire that real fast. And then we're going to shoot our scout arrow. See what enemies are doing. We got one. Yeah, I got fully smoked off. I guess I'm going to be an aggressive sniper here. Oh, it doesn't even matter. Jeez, my team just kicked butt. They actually full wiped over here on the B site. Hey, we got the halftime MVP. Even though I feel like I slowed down, I still had seven kills with nine assists. I was definitely like doing a lot of damage. That's for sure. Oh, yeah, that was an amazing arrow. Look at that. A lot of recon. That player weak. I'm just gonna keep spraying. Nice. Little blind shot. And there's still the one back here that's pretty dang weak. Although they do have the sheriff. Oh, AKA the heavy pistol, which is like a one tap to the dome. So that thing's deadly. We got such little HP. Hey, our sage or whatever the heck their name is. Elixir just healed me up. Nice. All right, run with the knife out real quick. Again, just like Valorant, you have the two different versions of the knife. Oh, I got a shot down. Yo, how's this player still alive? Jesus. Uh, I probably hit him for like 50 plus in the back. I'll be honest, I don't really know how to use the heavy pistol all too well in this game. Like, I know, you know, you hit a headshot and it's a one tap, but I just haven't been able to hit headshots. Not a bad game. Definitely slowed down. I had eight kills, three deaths, and 11 assists. The assists are where we went crazy. I'm gonna see if we can try to get, like, some more finishes this round, but that was definitely better than our first ever ranked match. All right, we're gonna use a different character. This is Blast, right? Yeah, yeah. This is the guy that I've been using so far, so we'll try him out. It's the same exact map. I feel like it is. Okay. Uh, USP light armor again. Let's get it i'm not gonna be able to recon off the start of the rounds but i do have my cluster like nades which are crazy good Ooh, it might even be worth me going over here and doing that mid i feel like more players probably peak mid than the catwalk so i can definitely like wide peak this drop the nades hopefully do a lot of damage before like getting killed let me just get the right angle here round start yeah yeah there's a couple guys there there we go did some damage hey that's what i'm talking about baby that's a play I'm gonna go ahead and rush Three the catwalk now ready. aggressively. We got footsteps. Okay. This guy's got the frenzy. Where the heck did you come from? Jesus. That guy's bad. Yo, shout out to my teammate who saved my life. Whoever killed that guy at the like mid area. I feel like the last player is probably over here. I'm gonna start walking so they don't know I'm coming. Because I feel like this guy's probably just defending the bomb. Yeah, yeah. Their footsteps popped up. They're mid. 30 seconds left. Round nice. Figured they were probably weak or something. Uh, you know what? We're going to buy the UMP this round. Full armor and then one jetpack. So we definitely bought heavy, but I feel like we should be able to get a lot of kills here at the UMP. I don't know how good it is, but I'm just assuming based off of how the Spectre is in a round two of Valorant, it's probably pretty nasty. I'm going to do the same thing with the nades too. Oh, shoot. Oh, God. Okay. Got some good shots. Didn't take any damage. I'm going to go ahead and rotate this around to A. Just because I'd much rather challenge, like, close range. That guy's hurt. Ah. Sensitivity's super low in this game. Nice. Uh, can I get some heals, maybe? I feel like this guy's probably heaven. I'm not trying to die. Screw it! Ah! Spotted. Wait, our spawn? Got this player one hit. There we go. Team actually getting that clean up. I'm gonna do what I tried to do that one round before I got smoked off, and that's Barret, the catwalk. Oh, absolutely nothing. Hmm. I know there's a second there. I don't think they'd expect me to challenge from up top. There's another. Hmm. Come on. Oh my god. There's still the one here. 
Right, just keep trying to break distance. Oh, shoot. There's a guy behind me. Er, that was a drone shooting me, I think. A turret. Oh, and that was our last teammate alive because this little last one's AFK. Pain. Pain and suffering. That could have been a clutch little ace. It was a good nade play. Dang, that was an expensive round loss, too, because I bought the bear. Like, I full sent buying, so now I'm broke. I'm thinking we rush plant B here. Round start. Oh, damn. Ouch. Those are good nades. Let's see if I made him back. Oh, he hit me with his ult. I forgot I even had my ult. He hit me with the freaking jetpack launcher shot. That was actually nuts. Props to him. I'm going to do that to somebody else now. I feel like since we're down a man, the enemies are getting a little, like, aggressive. So one of them might, like, push up like they did last round. I left. That hits. Okay. Oh, I'm in a 2v1. Coming around right here. Double kill. 30 seconds left. Round Let's eight. go. I needed that. Oh, man. That was clutch. That was clutch. We're still in it. That one tap was so clutch because I like just barely turned and flicked. Like I said, my sensitivity is super low in this game, as a lot of people's are probably in like a game like this. But like between that and me playing on a phone, it's just like double low sensitivity not really much space to work with so i have to like swipe four times or something to like do a 180 okay we're swapping sides so we're on defense now it's gonna be a little harder to defend with the sides man disadvantage but fingers crossed we can pull this out of our butts i'm gonna actually get the cz 75 here off the start and i have armor already compensation full armor for our teammate not being here that's actually cracked okay so the reason i bought the full auto is because i'm assuming we're gonna have like one or two players like hit b here hard so I just want to be ready for it. I'm also going to try to like pre-nade this. Star. The enemy is in sight. Nothing. I was right though. They did hit this hard. Wait. Dang. I went A. I'm screwed. Three kills remaining. Double kill. Triple kill. You challenge me? Ah, oh, my God. I had no ammo. That would have been so clutch. I needed that so bad. They hit that hard, too. I will say, at least this game really tries its best to, like, make up for you losing a teammate in ranked. I think what I might just do is hold this with my ult. I didn't realize I had a time limit on this. Come on. Okay. Did some good damage there. More damage. These guys have all got to be hurt, hurt. Blizzard incoming. Four kills I saw there's a second guy back there. Double kill. Nice. Triple kill. Okay. Just you. <sighs> Pain, dude. They flanked me so hard and I got, like, caught there in the open. I think enemies are coming around over here. Three kills remaining. I don't know why that guy looked at me, to be completely honest. And I got sight down. Oh, that was a double kill? Let's go, baby. Where the heck's the spike? The guy's above me, heaven. Please. 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 No! <laughs> I thought I was sprinting. If I would have sprinted to it, I would have had it. Oh my gosh. Hey, GG's, dude. That was a good gameplay for the fact that we were a man down. We're gonna hop into one more. This is probably gonna be a super long video, but I really wanna end on a win. I managed to snag up Blood Raider here for this matchup. I wanted to go Valkyrie, but our teammate grabbed it, and that's fine with me. But Blood Raider is very similar to Reyna from Valorant. So this character has an eye stun or blind that he throws out. But then unlike Valorant in this game, that blind actually will like chase down players near. Then I do have the ability to heal off of kills and assists. Again, that's directly from Reyna. And then the ultimate is identical to Reyna's where you basically have your enemies highlighted red and you get to heal and go invincible. But if you had blast, you could jump up there and then jetpack up there and peek that window. Looks like enemies might be pushing this. 
waiting to hear something or waiting for our teammate to shoot. Oh, is that an ice trap? Surrender to the darkness. Yeah, that went nowhere. So there's nobody here. At least nobody close enough for that to have chased. Scan the area, Pepe. Four kills oh, remaining. okay, I can heal up. That's good, because I got so weak. I'll wide peek this, why not? Enemies are probably A. Locked and loaded. Double kill. I have the ability to heal. Deployed. They just dropped the bomb. Triple kill. Nice. Hmm. Where's the bomb? I'm gonna go ahead and start defusing it. Our teammate's standing right in front of us, and I hate that. <gasps> oh god. No, dude, I was stuck on sight there. What is my teammate doing? Why did he run way back there? Dog, I had that so close to being defused as well. So similar to Valorant, when you hop on the site, it does save progression. But unlike Valorant, it's not at the halfway mark and it can actually like fall back and be reduced. So basically I was like, let me hop off for a second, try to pre-fire, make this guy think that I'm not defusing. But yeah, that didn't work out. And then I just got attacked from all angles. Ooh, dang. Uh, Let me buy the... UMP and then full armor. I'm just gonna full send this entire round here. I can even purchase a blindness too. Shield, my defense. Surrender to the darkness. Four kills remain. It's too blind. I really need this kill. No, I'm getting swamped, bro. I'm the only one getting kills. This better not be a repeat of last round. Round lost. <laughs> just got nice. Oh my gosh, I can't believe it. I full spent that round as well. I can still get an AR. I'm going to do the QBZ because this thing is actually extremely accurate. And this round's pretty much all or nothing. We need to win this one. Otherwise, we're in big trouble. I'm down to play this aggressive and just like run straight into this cubby. Round start. Locked and loaded. Yeah, enemies are pushing this for sure. I saw we had two. Blizzard incoming. Figured he'd re-peek there. Kill. Nice. That was a huge double to get. Give me that's all you. Ow. Why did I just get lit up in the back? If I get a kill here, I can heal up, which would be super helpful. I hope they didn't see me. Yeah, I need that heal. He's up top. Ten seconds left. Is it right here? There we go. And I just healed for no reason. <laughs> uh, I was curious if maybe you get overcharged for shields, but dude, 4K, and we ended up winning that round. That was much needed. I want to buy the M249 so bad. This is gonna be a struggle full match, man. I already feel it. There's players here. They might be pushing us. Where do we lose a teammate mid? Four kills remaining. I have a feeling they're gonna go mid. Yeah, they're definitely mid. Two kills remaining. What are we shooting at? I hear nothing at B. I think they just saved. Time's up. Yeah, they did nothing. What was that all about? Okay, I have no idea, but that's a comeback. 2-2, two, two, we're tied. I'm kind of feeling myself with the QBZ. But you know what? Let me go for the M249, because this thing's actually nasty. I watched someone use this thing. And look at that. It's got like no bloom in the beginning of the like first five shots or so. And with the 80 round mag, it's nasty. If you play Valorant, I would compare this to like the Ares. Bro. My team played that wild. Is this guy not in the hallway? No, no, he's on site. Nice. Good win. I'm going to play aggressive here and pop my ult off the start. My death will lead to a greater future. Four kills there we remaining. go. Keep moving forward. Might be on a massive flank. Kill. One more right here. Oh, he's right there. <laughs> I don't know why I didn't see him. Hey, I'm gonna kill off the ace. Find forward. No! My ace! <laughs> Hey, you know what? The teammate got the clean up there. I guess he didn't get stunned by that, or maybe the blind just ended as I peeked that. I was not expecting them to be in that corner. 
you know that's fine because now i can like spend my money heavily we're gonna go bear it that lmg is nuts dude like it sprays really well so if you're a spray and pray player that's the gun for you that and the qbz i think are the two like best for spraying oh we just lost teammates at a don't like that there's one i saw there's a second over there too one ally left just me he get oh god he peeked it oh god they all peeked it <laughs> oh how did i miss that did i shoot like in between their legs oh Sniping, not my strong suit. Hey, 15 kills at the half, though. We're definitely putting up big switched. numbers. It's four to three, though. Damn, that was a big round. I should have, well, obviously, I should have won. But, dude, imagine if I would have won that. That would have been nuts. I guess we just USB and armor. We're setting up for an A push. Okay, I love to see it. I got you guys with the blind off the rip. There you go. So nobody peeked it with me. We got flanked. Four kills remaining. The storm rolls in. Are they flanking again? Oh, I need to get this kill or assist even. That sucks. Good wall, but I hate my positioning. I'm surrounded with 12 HP. I need a kill so I can get heals. That guy doesn't seem to be pushing. We gotta push this. Oh, there's a guy close. No. Come on, get this kill. Two kills nice. Remaining. Up top. Uh, Only thing is we don't have enough time to plant. Someone needs to go for A. Even if they get this kill, they wasted all their time. We lose this round. Stop. Dang, Start dude. Operation. That's unfortunate. We really get needed that it. round. Four to four. And at least I have the ability to heal up twice now. And my ult if I get a kill. I'm going to play aggressive again here off the rip. Hopefully my team follows. Locked and loaded. Darkness descends. Nothing. I think they might be pushing mid. By might, they definitely are. Four kills remaining. Okay, didn't take any damage. I like that wall. Yeah, I like that play. Because they are mid. I'm gonna pop my ult. Okay, we have control. Nice. Good shield, too. Pop that heal. Yeah, there's a lot there, but they don't have time to get the defuse, so we should win this round. GG's, let's go. Oh, you don't have to go back and defend. You're good, bro. Two kills Let's get it, baby. Okay. Big round right there. Five to four. We finally took the lead. Check out this stun command. Three kills remaining. Big kill. I need that. No, he caught me. Come on, 3v2. We have numbers. This is looking good. I think this is supposed to be Killjoy right here, this character that we're watching. Yeah, the grenade and the turret. There's one on plant. Nice, bro. That wall was nice. One enemy remaining. All right, y'all know where the last guy's at. Go plant bomb. Please plant. No shot. Thank you. Oh my gosh. I don't think they would have planted either. <laughs> I got to grab bomb right off the rip. Pop that. And then we're going to blind forward. That's a lot of players. Oh my gosh. I'm alive. I'm alive. I'm alive. Surrender to the darkness. Try to keep it that way. Dang. I know where they are mm. doing. Four kills remaining. Okay. Big, big kill to get. Ooh. Let the massacre begin. Uh, I'm alone. Enemies know exactly where I'm at, too. Ah, GG's. Again, I'm not doing too good on eco at the moment. Let me grab that. Let's go B. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's hit B hard. Come on now. I can do the, the double blind push. Oh, this could be good. Round start. Darkness descends. Locked and loaded. Four kills remaining. Nice. I'm gonna plant this right away, too. Starcore deployed. That's big. Enemies are taking their sweet time coming up over here too. Three kills remaining. Two kills remaining. My blood and my armor are one. One enemy remaining. Blizzard incoming. All right, GGs. You won the round. 
I'm probably dead though. Ah, no! <laughs> I got all those kills. Oh, GG's. I tried to get away last second. Hell yeah, that was a big round to get too. Enemies are probably like slightly confused now on where we're gonna push again. So I bet they like split their defense 50-50. I'm gonna whip out the Barret. Darkness descends. Oh, they flanked. No. They flanked so fast, too. And so many. What is going on? What are you doing? Oh, my gosh. Oh, this is bad. This is so bad. We have no eco going into this next round. Oh, no. Dude, I have no money. I'm broke, broke. They full sent the defense at B. All right, whatever. Come on, squad. Let's push this. Uh, I have enough. I can get another flash. We gotta hit this hard. Round start. Look. They're pushing it. Four kills remain. Big first blood. Darkness descends. Nobody's here. Come on, boys. Let's clear this out. Ice core deployed. Embrace the cold. Like this. This is gonna be a hard bomb to defuse too. Star core deployed. <sighs> Shield, my death is cannot stop me. I'm deep in their spawn. Behind at least one. Double kill. Triple kill. Let's go! Victory. Little ace. Little ace to win the game. That's what I'm talking about, baby. Hey. Hey, GG's. How many kills do we have that round? That was a lot. 28 and 9 with 7 assists. Ooh. Hey, geez. All right, that's a satisfying game to end on right there, man. Thank you all so much for tuning in here to our Hyper Front video. Shout out to all of you guys who made it here all the way to the end. What a banger way to close out the video. If you guys all want to see more Hyper Front on the channel, let me know down in the comment section below. Smash like, of course. The more interactions and stuff I see on the video, the more I'll know that you guys do want to see it. So that's why that's always helpful. But as far as my first impressions go of the game, it's a lot of fun. Uh, NetEase, they did a great job at recreating Valorant for mobile before Valorant mobile comes out. So this might be something that if you guys really want to see it, I'll come back and play a couple times a week. Cannot wait for the full release of the game. Playing it on a tablet is probably going to be a lot of fun just because of how much fun I had here on a device that I'm not super comfortable with. So yeah, it was a it was a good time. Hope you guys all did enjoy as much as I did. But with all that being said, everybody, that will do it here for myself and I'll catch you all in the next one.